I'm Ryan Vanderplatz, and I'm Product Manager for Management Information Systems with Trimble Solutions. We're going to take a look at uh, our production control accessory finish enhancement. And that's a lot of words basically to say that we can now support a different finish on the main member uh, as opposed to an accessory or a part mark. And this, uh, this will uh, import from um, Tecla structures and other detailing softwares correctly. So let's take a look inside EPM and look at an example of how the finish can be set separately for an accessory mark um, as opposed to its main member. So on this job, I'm going to colorize by finish just so we get a graphical overview of what's happening. And we can see that orange is painted in this scenario and the light blue is galvanized. So essentially what's happening is the, the main structure is painted and these uh, sort of bump outs are, are galvanized or exposed steel. And as we zoom in, we can see that we have a member here. We're going to select from the model. This particular member here the main member is a painted member. However, there are a bunch of connection plates that are connecting this this uh, this steel. So let's go ahead and isolate this in the model, and we can see that all of the connections to that outside steel are galvanized now. Uh, previously, this was a was an issue that. Um, the finish had to be the same as the main member. And it should be pointed out that if you're setting your finishes in your model, um, in Tecla structures, that now they'll import correctly as well. 